In this video, I'm going to show you something you can do with legato to make learning picking licks even easier. So this is something you can do to make string crossing even easier. So if you started getting into the realm of string crossing, you can add legato to make it a lot more manageable. So you can just focus on the necessary pick strokes, uh, the really crucial pick strokes to get more used to the way it should feel. So for example, if you have uh, a lick like this, like that, an ascending six note lick, instead of just keep going like this, which might be a bit too much for you at the moment, just do this instead. All you're gonna do is pick the first four notes and then hammer on the last two notes, okay? So that way you're not having to pick every single note and then do that second string cross back to the D string. Like that. You'll get to that eventually, but for now, you just wanna give yourself a bit of a break and just do the one string cross, practice that correctly like this. But this is a way you can loop it, so you can keep practicing it in a way where you can get the timing of it, you can really get the feel. And then as you get better and better at it, you can start adding in the re those remaining picked notes. And, and so you're eventually doing this. Okay, but this is how it starts. And you can do the same thing uh, with descending. It's a really good way of getting used to the feel of inside picking, for example. If you go down, up, down, up, and then pull off, pull off on the D string. So it gets you used to the feel of picking in between the strings without you getting really overwhelmed trying to do one of these licks and then, and then getting all tangled up and blah, 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 blah. You know how it is. So there you go. That's how you use legato to make string crossing a lot easier so you can just get used to the feel of these string crossing picking motions. And then as you get more comfortable with them, you can just start filling in those notes and pick everything until you're a string crossing speed monster. Okay, that's it for this episode. I'll see you next week for the next one. Okay, so see you around. Yeah.